You can even use the techni technology uh, to refurbish uh, older houses, and uh, that we are we are doing in Sweden now. In Sweden, uh, they were built uh, between 1963 and 1973. One million new homes in uh, in uh, one-family houses and also in multi-family houses. And uh, Sweden has a uh, population of nine million people, so one million, that's a lot. And those homes are now, now 35, 40 years old, and uh, we have to refurbish them. And we can refurbish them with the passive house technology and reduce the, the energy use in the homes very much. It's so much, uh, if you... Um, uh, build, re uh, refurbish those houses which which are needed to re refurbish. It's, it's about 800,000 uh, homes. And uh, that means that you save so much energy as uh, 300,000 new built one family house, homes. And that's very good for the climate uh, uh, changes. Uh, seven terawatt hours, it's the same energy as is used in three, four nuclear uh, plants. So it's much. And and all of these uh, refurbishment, uh, the, the lifetime costs are lower than if you refurbish them in other ways. So in, in the end, it's cheaper to live in those houses. It's good for the society, it's good for the families. And also you get a lot of uh, new jobs for uh, uh, the building industry. And you get rid of a little of the unemployment in society. So I think uh, passive houses is the future. I've been working with architecture since 1974. So um, it's a lot of years and now first uh, the two, three last years the, there has been a more or less explosion of building of uh, passive houses. And it's an international uh, movement. In Austria, they have uh, uh, they, almost all new built houses are passive houses now. And the um, European Union has a new uh, uh, has new law, so to say, which is uh, the, going to, to be realized in 2019-2020, uh, uh, where we go out from the heat losses from passive house and serve the houses with uh, uh, renewable energy. And it's time to do something. I think it's uh, quite a good idea and we have only good, re uh, only good um, experiences of the passive houses. Uh, comfort, healthy and low cost. <laughs>